Donc nous, on, nous, nous commençons cette, euh, cette conférence. Donc euh, bonjour à, à, à toutes et, et à tous. Good morning to all. Um, um, I, pro I propose uh, to listen uh, now uh, Martin um, for a brief uh, introduction and uh, presentation of uh, the current uh, events of the Cultural Plus uh, project. Yes, uh, thank you very much. I'm going to um, share my screen again. Hopefully it goes all right. Uh, hopefully all of you are uh, listening to me all right. Maybe you are also, I don't know if you are seeing me, but I see Laurent in my screen. <laughs> but anyway, it's a good, good sight. <laughs> So I'm going to just go very quickly to present our Cultural Plus Strategic Partnership presentation. Oh yes, Strategic Partnership, sorry. Uh, it's a Erasmus Plus uh, key action for the sector of adult education. <clears throat> the name, the complete name of the project of the partnership is Entrepreneurship Education and Cultural Heritage Cre Creative Management for Rural Development. So uh, we have these uh, key words, key concepts, entrepreneurship education for rural entrepreneurs and rural mediators, cultural heritage and rural development. <clears throat> this is our acronym, Cultural Plus. The duration of the project, it started uh, the 1st of September in 2019. It will end because we have uh, asked for an extension. Uh, so it will last 36 months and end in August 2022. What are the challenges of our project, of our uh, strategic partnership, aging in the rural areas of Europe, uh, depopulated or in processes of the population uh, and the abandonment of rural heritage and rural resources. We search uh, for good practices, models and cases uh, with uh, dealing mostly with uh, cultural heritage, with cultural culture and with arts. Um, so we have found some cases uh, among music festivals, uh, also cases of social and community archaeology, also artistic interventions and micro residences, thematic routes and villages as the Silver Way, uh, Ruta Via de la Plata in Spain, in our region, crossing Extremadura from south to north, or via Francigena in Italy. We have studied in former projects and, and supported. And also historic recreations, and sorry about this, and other cases uh, that are uh, bringing some cultural dynamization to and rural development to the villages. <clears throat> what are our objectives? To introduce rural and, and entrepreneurs, sorry, rural entrepreneurs and mediators to strategic training, networking, community of practice and learning and internationalization. These are our partners. Uh, many of you are uh, between us now, so thank you uh, to Ayuntamiento de Farcadona, sorry, Municipality of Farcadona, Taste Roots, Time Heritage, uh, Instituto Berne. Thank you for hosting this conference. Very hard times for this, but. Ruralidad de Verde, and I skip one slide, that is this one. Universidad de Trasos Montes y Alto Douro, Municipality of Torre Orgaz, and uh, coordinating the University of Extremadura. Um, 
the team coordinate. Sorry, I'm going to read first this one. The project uh, will set up or is setting up five integrated teams, one in each country that uh, are joining uh, virtually and presentially or will join. We are starting with this in a community of practice or what we call a learning and knowledge sharing community. Um, we have planned five international weeks, including international conference as this one, uh, linguistical and cultural immersions, um, and other uh, other events that uh, we designed that uh, we are not planning the proposal, but we are we are designing and organizing. Um, these are ways in which participants improve uh, their internationalization skills. Sorry. Very nice screen. I the team coordinators in the five regions uh, from the partner organizations are responsible to search from the most innovative uh, e-learning technologies and courses to offer uh, past participant adult learners. We have a permanent open call. Uh, you can enter in our uh, uh, web page that is uh, at the end. I can after also we can put the links in the chat. Uh, Cultural Plus is going to reward also motivation, participation and creativity with three prizes, one to the more impacting project, one to the more intense participation and one to the best uh, learning trajectory. Uh, the intellectual outputs of these strategic partnerships are an interactive map showing innovative and good practices database and trying also to show uh, some indicators on the population that will be my next uh, communication. Uh, we have a coaching and training program starting starting now and in this program we try to to gather and to show this uh, and to design webin webinars and educational resources for rural entrepreneurs and mediators we are uh, writing also and editing guidelines and handbooks for rural entrepreneurs and mediators and we try to um, manage and to give life and dynamize dynamize our learning and knowledge sharing community for example one of these uh, activities that we are not foreseen and we are uh, profiting of our cost management uh, allocations uh, project management allocation to uh, encourage this kind of uh, workshops that we call PILS, Cultural Plus PILS for Rural Entrepreneurship Diversification and Self-Sufficiency. So we are programming uh, some workshops in um, mushrooms, cultivation, in uh, adobe uh, constructions, uh, traditional building, techniques and um, clay, clay also fundamentals. So we think that uh, new rural uh, newcomers, uh, mediators, entrepreneurs should also have uh, these skills and some uh, degree of self-sufficiency. This is all uh, for this project strategic partnership uh, presentation. I will try to pass it to you, but it's from Canva and I still trying to manage it. I'm going to present uh, very quickly also our um, our program uh, coaching and training program. Hopefully I can 
come to it. This one. This is the program we are offering to uh, our, what we call uh, rural entrepreneurs and mediators. Um, it's something that we have all, all partners uh, or most of the partners uh, wanted to collaborate and to take our expertise, expertise to, uh, to help our adult learners with some uh, interesting subjects uh, like the rural biodiversity. This is uh, from Ruralidad de Verde uh, module, Entangling People, Territory, Traditions and Sustainability. The second one will be on cultural heritage for local communities. This is from Greece, from Time Heritage. Territorial resources and tourism development in the populated rural areas. This uh, is from IADT, France. Digital marketing and data for business and promotions. This is uh, from Italy, uh, Taste Roots. Local administration and governance in rural areas. This is from our municipality of Torre Orgaz and international project management, um, mostly in the Erasmus program and this kind of uh, strategic partnership. Uh, this will be our University of Extremadura contribution to the program. The schedule is um, basically one one each month. It's monthly a monthly uh, workshop. They will be open workshops, so you can attend. Uh, it will be also virtual and presential, the both semi blended. No, so you can. This is uh, the activities that are also in our agenda. This is happening today. We have this cultural peace program, the personalized individual sessions, uh, working sessions, uh, some uh, meetings uh, with all cultural areas, some congresses like this, art, literature, and landscape. Mm. Another international week, international week holding uh, hosting a conference. Uh, in Greece, in March, in Portugal, in September 21, uh, dealing with cultural heritage, tourism and education. And in June 22 will be the Cultural Plus Prizes Award. We will have in 22, hopefully, uh, the International Week in the March 22, if we can do it. <laughs> in Italy, the last uh, International Week, International Conference, Learning Activity in Cori in June. And we'll try also to support one of our entrepreneurs projects. It's a festival called Plena Moon, uh, dealing with uh, the, the full moon, uh, taking place uh, every full moon of uh, spring and summer, doing uh, some art, uh, poetry, music activities. Very nice festival. And this is it for, for the Cultural Plus presentation. Thank you. Merci, thank you, Martin.